good morning or whatever time of day it is when you're watching this video I'm going to be taking you on a, a special little adventure with me I'm going to take you back into the uh, deep woods where I found my very first fishing spider and I didn't even know what it was to me it looked like a, a wolf spider but I noticed that the the head, the carapace area, was a little bit taller uh, for a wolf spider, anyway. And this spider didn't have that taller forehead, if you will. Uh, but I'm going to take you back and show you where I discovered for the very first time the fishing spider. It's going to be cold out there, like it's 6 to 8 degrees and uh, snow. Um, and it won't look at all like what it looked like when I was hunting that day, oh, five, six years ago. But let's go back. Let the adventure begin. I don't think this was a very good idea. It's about 11, 12 degrees. Glasses keep steaming up and it's very cold. And I'm walking in about, in some places, knee deep snow. So it's a lot of extra work for the old guy here. But I'm getting closer to the place where I found my original dark fishing spider. I didn't even know it was a dark fishing spider at the time. Ah, ah there you are. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> I'm going to keep moving to that spot five or six years ago where I found that spider. I remember this creek here that flowed downhill right down to the Rabbit River, which is out over that way. There's the Rabbit River. When there's snow and ice. Everything looks the same out here with all the snow. Ah, hard to tell exactly where I was, but it was under, uh, oh, there goes a hawk. Nice. But it was under some snow, or <laughs> I'm under snow, I'm snow fogged. Uh, it was near a kind of a, a mucky area close to where the uh, pond was. And um, uh, it was uh, full of mosquitoes the way I remember it. And they were just biting me like crazy. Anyway, it was something like this. It was a lot bigger piece of wood, but it was kind of like I would flip this big piece over and then on the underside is where the spider appeared um, back in the day when I found my first fishing spider on the underside of the flipped over skin of the tree. Guess that's all I'm gonna get because I can't find the exact spot not in the winter time anyway. All right Let's get on with the adventure of how I found that fishing spider that day and later on had to figure out what it was. All right. Gonna look under a leftover parts of a uh, 
tree here. Maybe we'll get lucky and see a salamander or a potential spider. So let's take a look under this log over here. See what we can find. Aha! We got a spider. Lousy mosquitoes are eating me up, even in spite of my mosquito repellent. So I ain't gonna be staying here too long, I can guarantee you that. <laughs> well, that didn't work very well, did it? <laughs> He's off and running. Thanks for watching and have yourself a great day. Take care.